Celebrating International Women's Day is happening everywhere from social media to the local ski slopes. NBC5's John Hawks takes us to the resort proving girl pow power and fresh powder go very well together. Okimo Mountain Resort staffing an all-women ski patrol Wednesday. You do need a rope for real jam. We'll get it to the top of the quads for you. The first time the mountain has been able to do this on International Women's Day. International Women's Day is about women holding up other women and, uh, yeah, promoting their strength and success at work. And we do that pretty well here at Okimo. The field is male-dominated since the inception of ski patrolling. I think a little bit of that macho kind of old boys club attitude has acted as a barrier to a lot of women just in the way that we think about it. You know, like, oh, I don't know if I could actually be a ski patroller. You know, I'm too small or I don't go to the gym or anything like that. Some of the patrollers think it's the nature of the work and people's mindset about the job. Because it's an outdoor environment, it's very harsh. You know, it takes a certain kind of person who's comfortable in this environment, whether it's they're female or male. Everyone on the team goes through rigorous trainings, a multi-week course in the classroom, and then more hands-on training on the mountain learning how to put up fences, dealing with trails and rope, along with the first aid component. You know, it's a little different. It's easy to put someone on a backboard in a classroom, but in conditions like this where it's snowing and blowing, it adds a level of difficulty into it as well that we had to learn how to master. And the work and the work ethic goes beyond just one day. I think it's really cool that we have the capacity to be able to do this here, um, but really it's just gonna feel like a normal day. I mean, we're, we have a lot more food than usual, but we'll be out there and you know, just doing our job. Patrollers are given their assignments at the ski patrol hut at the summit. When you get a chance, you look at the group chat? And start the day by sweeping all open trails, putting out signs, and looking for any hazards before trails open. They monitor and adjust for conditions throughout the day and are always on standby in case a skier or snowboarder needs help. Okimo's patrollers take great pride in their work, ensuring better representation on every mountain. I think it is really important for that representation just so, you know, like little kids growing up on skis can say like, oh wow, like that ski patroller, she's a girl, you know, and she's helping someone out, you know. I feel like that kind of goes across all fields is seeing representation and seeing yourself in those positions is really helpful for people trying to, you know, push their boundaries and dream bigger. Blazing a trail for the next generation. In Ludlow, John Hawks, NBC5 News. And coming up on NBC Nightly News.